Hi everyone, this is Teddy Bear Hugs here and today we are going to paint a cute little penguin which I have had for a while now. This penguin shown on the right hand top corner is what we are going to paint today. We will paint it in an app called Call This Paint 3D. This app is available on Windows 10 PC. If you guys did not know, this is my first video on YouTube, so if you like it, then please hit the like button and subscribe button. Okay, let's get started now. When you open up Paint 3D, it looks something like this. And first I'll show you all the buttons. This is the marker. I never used this, but it's called the calligraphy pen something. And this is the oil brush, this is the watercolor, and this is the pixel pen. And this is the pencil, as you can see. And this is the eraser, as you can see. And here's a crayon, and a spray can, and a fill. And you can see what it says up here. And thickness, and let me show you. So, for example, I'll use the oil brush. So if it's this thick, I reduce it to this thick. It's smaller now. And for a marker, it's called opacity, and it makes it clear. If it's 100%, then it's clear. I mean, not clear, but you can make it clear. So it's not working. What we're going to paint today, we're going to paint a penguin. So let's get started. Um, we won't be using the aqua, we actually will, but it's at the end, so we'll use turquoise. It's too thick, so I need to reduce it to a little smaller. That's too small. This is perfect. Oh, I didn't need a marker. I needed the oil brush. Okay guys, it kind of looks like a D, so we'll fix that. If you do it undo, it does it, un it undoes it from the bottom, like what you did last, so I'm needing the, I'm going to need the eraser. I'm just going to erase this part because it kind of looks like a D. Now I'm going to go back to the oil brush. Keep making. So now we are 
going to, these are the colors you can pick. And we are going to pick, oh, no, wait. I still need it to make the arms. I don't know if it's going to be a dancing penguin. Might be. Arms look kind of angry. You can just press the undo button. It'll undo whatever you did. And the redo button. It redoes what you did. And guys, these buttons, we're not really going to use them, but stickers, my favorite part about them, it's like realistic. And you can also do smiley stickers. But back to the brushes. Some of these buttons I've never used before. This one's a bit bigger, that one's a bit smaller. Okay, whatever. I can't do do it like it's actually facing like it's actually over um on its body, but it's like it's going to be angry. If this was closed, it would be Angry Penguin. So now we need black, um, not oil brush. This is the marker. It, the marker looks like this. I guess this is good. Oh no, I didn't want it gray. Wait, what? What's wrong? I did black. When I did the black, it's just coming as gray. I'm not sure what's wrong. Let me try it smaller. It used to work before. What's wrong? It's just coming out as gray. I guess we can try it again. So I guess we'll try it in pencil or no, we're already in marker, so um what? I don't know what's wrong. So guys, I guess we'll just have to leave it gray. Well, if it was black, it would be better. Wait, can I actually... Oh, I can make it black by pressing it a lot of times. Okay, but... I want to erase it because it's a bit too small. So, again, this is for the thickness. As you can see, it says thickness again. Oh, that is way too big. Press it a lot of times. Wait, no, I'm in racer. Better be marker. Uh oh, I did the thickness of the eraser. big. I don't know why I'm messing up. Um, I guess that's a bit too big. No, a bit too small. Okay, this is good. Okay, 
Okay, and we still need the marker to do its belly stripes. Okay, just need to make and just need to make it smaller. It's a bit too small. And we need to do its nose. Need to make it a hundred if it has to be like this. Wait, that looks a bit ugly. Let's make it better. Okay. Wait. That's better. I'm gonna make it a bit less thick. Oops. And this one, it's three striped things. Now two again. So need to make it a bit. Okay, the feet are done, and now we could make a background, and I think I want to make a background. So all you have to do is go to Fill Bucket. It says Fill, but it's called Fill Bucket. Well, if you want to see what this button is, it's just these stuff. I don't know what they actually do. So we are going to take Aqua. You can actually do it any color of the background, and now I'm on opacity to be about oh, like 22. It says how much opacity you have over here and how much thickness you have over here. I don't know why it says this thing. And now it's a bit too light so make it 42. Uh, I guess the face is Okay, um, 42 is a bit less, I mean, more. Okay, I don't know why it's just covering the face, so just this light blue. So, okay, I think we're done. So if you like this, please hit that like button and subscribe. Thank you all for watching this video, and I will see you on the next video.